peace last year with some love. Jason Michael, just taking a moment here to contemplate something I was chewing on a little bit yesterday. I was out and about running some errands and I came across this mall and the music was just soothing. Just one of those, I don't know, it was ambient music, but I just felt soothed, I felt tranquil, I felt, I felt my nervous system just have a little bit of ease. It's the power of music, right? It just does it. And I started thinking about just humanity. That's what I do. I think about the big picture a lot. <clears throat> you know, tuning into the field, tuning into the collective. And I could feel that what's required so much right now is our nervous system to be comforted because we've been blasted with such loss and trauma for the last two and a half years or so. Every one of us, I'm sure, has some story of loss, whether, you know, this time of health initiation crisis, as I like to call it, took a life of somebody you love. You know, it almost took mine. We lost communities, lost relationships. We lost of some sorts. So there's a lot of trauma the last two and a half years and now we're dealing with this trauma of you know some people are really afraid of nuclear holocaust and I remember that feeling growing up in the 80s anybody else <laughs> uh, we grew up on the day after and you know fear is always around the corner it doesn't matter what age we are what generation it's sitting right there you know my son feels like his age is gonna see the apocalypse he doesn't have a lot of faith in his generation so there's just a lot of fear a lot of unease disease anxiety and I just really felt that I, what we require is whatever it takes to ease your nervous system. That could look different for each one of us, right? Prayerfully, it's not something that's going to harm you or harm another. Not so good. I would recommend meditation. You know, maybe you're saying, Jason Michael, I don't know how to meditate. And I say, that's okay. Just sit there for 22 minutes, put some good music, ambient music, maybe even put something on your Netflix, a little frequency or a visual, and just sit there for 22 minutes. Don't check your emails, don't scroll through your Facebook, don't do anything. Just sit, and when you can do that for 22 minutes, and make it somewhat of a regular, you don't have to do it every day, you don't have to take a big chunk, but just start doing it more than you are now. And watch what your nervous system does. Music, frequency, vibration. It may help you lift your vibration. And you might start experiencing things over time. You continue to make this a practice, because it is a practice, it is a discipline. Or as I've often heard Michael Beckwith say, it's a bliss discipline. It brings you to that state of higher ascended thinking. So, just a little tidbit. Have a great day. I appreciate your presence in the world because I know you volunteered to be here. I'd like to say we raised our cosmic wing before and said I'll be here at the greatest time, the most auspicious time, the revelation, the apocalypse. It's really here. Take it easy. Be graceful in yourself. All right, that's the video. So glad you tuned into the Mind Tribe, friend. If you're into this kind of content and want to go a little bit deeper down the rabbit hole, I have alternative channels on Rumble, BitChute, and Odyssey. I'll put links in the description below. And yeah, if you enjoyed this video, it really helps me out if you give the video a like. And if you're not already subscribed to this channel, click our logo here in the top right-hand corner to subscribe and hit the bell icon to be notified when we upload new videos. All right, that's it for now. Yeah, high vibes, high vibes, high vibes. Peace in the highest vibration. Yeah.